In this video, we are going to show you how to release grades and feedback that you have given to your student submissions in Moodle. First, go to the DLE and log in with your academic IT account. Once you are logged in, you will see the dashboard of your DLE. You need to search for the course and for the exact section where your assignment activity is located. It should have a hand holding a piece of paper icon. In our case, it is called Dartmoor Essay. Once you have found your assignment, click on it to open it on a new page. You will be directed to the dashboard of your student submissions. This is basically a grading summary of your assignment. You can see, for example, the number of the participants and the submissions, or for example, the status of these submissions, whether they need to be graded or not. To continue with the process, click on the View or Submissions button. A new page will open, which is also the dashboard of your assignment. Here, you will be able to get a more detailed information about the student submissions as they are separated into individual cases. As such, you will be able to see the identity of your students which have not been revealed yet, the status of their submissions, whether they have been submitted, not marked, marked, ready to be released or released, the marker if the submissions are allocated to teachers, the given grades, the time it has been last and modified, the files, and the comments added to it. Before you would release the grades and the feedback to your students, you need to reveal their identity. To do this, first, you need to select them from the list. You can select a few of them by ticking the box next to their identity or all of them by ticking the box where it says select. If you have more than one page of submissions, then you can scroll down on the dashboard to where it says assignments per page and change it to all to make sure that all of the submissions will be selected. You will see that the DLE will also highlight these submissions. After you have completed this part of the process, you need to click on the Choose button next to Grading Action and select Reverse Student Identities from the drop down list. A new page will open where you need to confirm your action as you cannot indicate. Once you have done it, you will see the names of your students instead of their identity, which was generated by the DLE. Again, you need to select a few or all of your students and set a marking workflow state. To do this, you need to scroll down on the list Click on the Lock Submission button and then select the option from the drop down list where it says Set a Marking Workflow State, Release Grades and Feedback. The system will ask you for confirmation. A new page will open where you will see the list of your students you have selected. You need to scroll down on the page and change the state of the grades to release, which is the last option from the drop-down list. 
please also make sure that you set the notifications on as it is important to notify your students about the grades they have received from you. Click on the Save Changes button to finalize your action. You will be directed back to the dashboard of your submissions. Under the Status column, you will be able to get confirmation that the grades have been successfully released.